What's up guys? Today I want to show you guys how to mint an NFT on the ZK Sync Layer 2 network. If you like this content, please hit the like and subscribe. And I appreciate you guys coming and showing support, but let's jump on in. So here, where you want to start out at is the ZK Sync wallet. If you haven't had one set up already, set, go ahead and set it up. It's very self-explanatory. And all you got to do after you set it up is bridge some funds from mainnet Ethereum over. But once you get it set up, you can mint NFTs. And the reason you want to do this is just to show that you're pretty active on the chain, just in case they have a possible airdrop in the future, just to show that you're active and you're a user, you know, and it just gives you a better probability if things were to happen. So what you want to do is you want to set up your ZK Sync wallet. Then you want to go over to ZK NFT. And once you're here at ZK NFT, this is the platform where you're going to mint your own NFT. So what you want to do is you want to connect your wallet here and it connects through MetaMask. And once you're connected, what you want to do is you want to go down here and you want to hit choose file. So you can choose any file from your phone. Um, so it's, it's basically going to be your personal, your own personal NFT that you can mint on the layer two. So I'm going to go to my photo library here and let's just say I'm going to mint a picture of my profile picture for my YouTube channel. Hit choose, name NFT, just put PFP, or whatever you wanna name it, I'm just gonna put profile picture. Description, I'm just gonna put the same thing to make it easier here. Um, you don't really have to put an external link, but you go down here to the bottom, hit mint NFT, you're gonna sign the transaction, and down here at the bottom you see it says your transaction was submitted, and you can track it there. But after you've done here, all you have to do is go back to your wallet, hit NFTs, and it'll show up in here. But guys, I just wanted to share this with you just so you can get a little bit more active on the ZK Sync network. I think this platform could be a very big deal in the future. But that's all I got for us today. I really appreciate y'all's support and y'all have a good one and I'll see you in the next one.